we are going to have like this maybe like the weekend or whatever might be different videos but I don't know so let's let's get started this week's video is a favorite person video and I will be talking about my favorite people and I have a lot of favorite people I only have one two three four five six seven eight nine nine lines in the alphabet so nine letters that do not have a name because either that's an uncommon letter for names or I just don't know anybody and if I forget anybody I will put it in the comments or the description if I forgot somebody but okay so letter A Ashton Rowland I love him even though it may sound pedophile-ish or whatever being that he's only turning 10 next month January, February, March, April, May. May 5th is his birthday, just just in case I'm wondering. <laughs> he's cute, and like, my aunt lives next to him, and it's so not fair. Lives next to the Rowan family, like, literally right next door, they're neighbors, like, it's not fair. Austin Mahone, I love Austin Mahone. A lot of people don't like him because of Becky G and all that. Whatever, I'm not starting drama in this video. Uh uh uh. But. <laughs> I love his song, All I Ever Need. <laughs> I understand he's way older than I am, but it's okay because why not just love somebody that's older than you? Because that's all it's pretty, that's this pretty much is. Aaron Carpenter. <laughs> he's one of my favorite people because he's just like cute and I don't know. he's so nice though. I met him on April 3rd. Because I went to my com. Um, I had VIP and family photo op. But I am not making a video to that because people say it's bragging, so just yeah. There is going to be no video to that. Okay, that is all I have for A. B. Blake Gray. <laughs> I, I love him because he's cute. But I kind of hate that he's 15 because he's older than me. But My aunt and my uncle that live in Texas live in the same neighborhood as him. And it's not fair. My aunt and my uncles live next to famous people. I live next to people that I don't even know. Like, what is this? It was Brandon Rowland. Also known as Ashley Rowland's brother. Um, he's my age, which is a good thing. It's prime. And, um, like, I don't really like him as much as I do his brothers. But it's okay, it's, it's fine. It's fine. Because I don't, okay, like, I don't want to tell people I don't like him. But, like, yet I got it. It's the truth. I'm not gonna lie. But, yeah. Bart, I don't really say it's awesome. That's very sad, but he's one of my favorite people. He is the, like, okay, you could say founder or creator of Megum. And he, okay, so like, it sounds weird that I like him because he's so, like, he's so much older than me, but I don't have to like people that are around my age, like, that's not a necessary thing. Um, um, I am just very thankful for him that he made Metcon because of Aaron. But, mm -hmm, that's all I have for B. C. Cameron Dallas. Um, I like him because he's just a really cute person, he's nice and he's caring. Um, I understand he's almost 23 years old, but it's okay. <laughs> um, Clint Green Deer. Um, he is part of, um, a band that I like, this band that's on my wrist. Um, this, I understand it's weird. But he's a really good singer and he's really good at playing guitar. Yes, okay. Chris Miles. Oh my god. He is the way to go. When I met him in Minneapolis, he was so caring. And like, people say that he's very sexual. It is very true. It is very true. Like, he, he walks up to me, he's just like, hi, he grabs my butt. It's like, Chris, what are you doing? He's like, oh, was I not supposed to do that? 
Okay. Um, this one is Dylan. I'm not even going to try to say his last name because I'm going to say it wrong. But it's D-A-U-Z-A-T. And I feel really bad that I can't even say his name. But his last name, but it's really hard. But he's at MetCon and he's so cute. I met him and he's just like, oh my god, he smells so good. I'm like, power of the perfume. <laughs> and he just laughed. He almost fell over because he laughed so hard. But okay, next letter. E. Edwin Burgos. He's part of Five Quad. I like him because he's, oh, okay, like he's, looks like he's always in a bad mood, but he's really not. Like, he's really caring. Um, when I went on the tour that they were on, like, I didn't go on the tour, but I went and met them. I had VIP for that, too, and that is not bright. This is not bright, but I met him, and he was so much taller than me. I'm only four foot four foot two five foot two and a half he is so much taller than me i feel like a midget next to him like he's not really really that tall to make me look like a midget but i felt like a midget yeah h hunter roman i really my ankle i like sprained my ankle and i was playing soccer but um hunter roman i love him as much as i love ashton i love Brandon, but he is just higher up on that level he is my daddy boo. Okay. I don't care. He's just the way to go. And my aunt has a little daughter, which would be my niece. Not my niece. My cousin. And she's in Girl Scouts. So she purposely FaceTimed me. She's nine. So she's friends with Ashton. But she's nine. And she's still in Girl Scouts, which I don't care because... I was in Girl Scouts till I was 11, but she walks up there and she's, and she knocks on the door and Hunter answers. She's like, are you Hunter? And she, he's like, yeah. Can you say hi to her? And I'm on the screen. I'm just like, I oh, no, 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 no. I love Ratchet. Don't do this. And then I met him. He's just like, hey, does your aunt, your uncle live next to me? And he said his address. I'm like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And Hey, does your aunt your uncle live next to me? And he said his address. I'm like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Jay, I have four people for Jay, and I'm just gonna say the most important. Um, <laughs> Jacob Sartorius. I love Jacob, but people say that he was, like, mean and rude when he meets people at Metcon. He's not mean and rude. He was, like, okay, he's kind of tall for his age. We get again his hair adds on. But, whatever. So I'm standing next to him, I'm just like, really, Jacob, why do you gotta be so tall? And he just laughs at me. It's like, okay, I'm done here. We take a picture, we pose, and then I walk away. He's just like, you're not gonna give me a hug? I'm like, I guess I'll short next to you. And so he bends down. <laughs> he comes and gives me a hug, but <laughs> it's fine. And then Johnny Orlando. I don't think that's his real name. I think it might be Orlando. But it's okay, because... I, okay, like, I didn't really know about him until my con. Like, I knew about him because I saw the special guest list, but, um, I, I don't know about him. So, it was kind of awkward meeting him because he purposely jumped out of line right after Jacob, up. But I didn't get a picture with him because I wasn't ready and I was just physically not mental. Mentally prepared for that, so. And then he came by me and then he walked away. I'm just like, I'm kind of glad I met you, but like, I don't even know you, so. Okay. I'm gonna skip Justin and Jonas, but I still love them. Um, because this video is going to be very long, so. L. Lauren Beat. I like Lauren because she's just a good impact in my life. Like, she's not, I don't really like personally know her, but like, she's made an impact on my life that. Even though she wears makeup and all, but it doesn't have to stop me from liking her. Because, like, just because somebody wears makeup doesn't mean I don't have to like them. Because a lot of my friends wear makeup and, um, they know I don't like makeup. So, they don't really, like, wear a lot because now I test them if they wear makeup because I do. A wet washcloth and I wipe and I see if they have makeup on. Otherwise, 
to do it and attach it for the rest of the day because then they'll come up to me when I'm wearing like a box watch or something and they'll wipe it on me. And I find that very rude. And yeah. Um, um I'm gonna just say one person behind me locks. Oh my god. Um she was a DJ the DJ for um my con Minneapolis and I was really glad because I watched a lot of her YouTube videos after I found out that they were that she was going to be the DJ. So then I really got to really like know her personality and I'm like, okay, this is gonna be good in class. This is gonna be good. And then I met her because she, I, I was part of the dance battle in the already at VIP, but I was going to be part of the dance battle. So I guess it made people sad that I went up there, even though I already had VIP. But okay, whatever. They can. I'm just gonna go to teas. Um, sorry, Simon, but I still love you. T. Taylor Kenneth. I love Taylor, and he's my favorite person from Mecon. No offense to anybody else that's from Mecon. Um, he's my favorite because he's just, I don't know, I love him to death. Like, oh my god. Um, like, he's just a supportive person, and he's always there. Like, he follows me on Twitter, but... Um, when I met him, I told him that he could unfollow me because, um, people were starting to say stuff about him, and they were tweeting at me for it, and I'm just like, uh-uh, this isn't gonna happen. So, he said, I don't want to unfollow a fan, or a supporter, or a family, family member, and I'm just like, well, it's probably, it'll probably do you the best. So, he did it, and I really regret that now, because... One of my friends thinks that they're more of a Taylor Kenneth fan than I am, which is very not true because I know everything about him. And yeah, okay, so W, Willie Jones. He, I don't really know him. I met him at MetCon when I went on stage, but he's um, a contestant of an American Idol, I believe. And he sings country songs, which I don't mind country, but. I'm more of a rock person, heavy metal, but I listen to any music, but, um, Z, oh, last but not least, Zachary Clayton, also known as bro, it's Zach, um, he, when I met him, he kind of, like, glared at me, and then I'm just like, and then, how are you doing, and he's just like, what, I'm just like, why are you glaring at me? And he's just like, I don't know, it's done by habit. I'm just like, I have been a fan of you, you know, since you had 10 viewers. Okay, I am he I've been here since day one, okay? I understand people don't believe me. I was. I almost had screenshots, but I deleted all my screenshots. I got Zach. Um, he glared at me, and people still don't believe me that I was there since day one. But that's a personal problem. So, yeah. That is all of them. I miss some people. People, but yes. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. Um, give it a like, a thumbs up, or a thumbs up. That's the same thing. Um, leave a comment on ideas that I should do for my next video. And, yeah. Um, subscribe. Um, I will put my three social medias like I did last time down below. Um, yeah, thank you!